guys b man here how are you guys doing today today we've got an awesome one for you guys they tried to patch how we save locked weapons and attachments from private games guys today but don't worry guys i've got the after patch for you guys i've got in and i've got another way for you guys to do this so today we've got another way for you guys to do the save guns from custom from private matches and stuff so you can get your locked guns like here you see right here we have the m13c from today's event but we haven't gone in and played today's event yet guys so we've just gone in and got the gun early so what you see here is we've got a gun and we've got it saved as a blueprint how they patched the last glitch guys is they made it so that when you glitch over to private matches that you can't save your gun in private matches anymore guys so what we've done is i've gone in and i've now got an after patch where you bring your private match to online and then you can save it here guys so with that said guys this requires the same as the past glitch so this does require that you have a banned account to be able to help you do this one as, uh, as an alt because and it has to be banned on modern warfare 2 okay so the alt account on your second controller needs to be a banned account so if you have a friend that's a hacker or something that's got banned accounts that's what this is for unfortunately guys i don't control what the requirements are for a glitch i'm just bringing the glitches to you guys so that you guys know about them so that is the requirement for this glitch if, it, if you don't have that requirement sorry maybe you'll have to, be able to do the next glitch but with that said guys before you click off smash that like button for me and i'll catch you in the next video but those that can do this and have an access to a band account let's get in and show you guys exactly what to do okay guys load into the game with the profile that's allowed to play and on player one right now i'm doing this in multiplayer version guys if you guys want me to make a warzone version of this get about a hundred people asking for that and i'll go along and do that but pretty much it's the same as this one guys all that you need to do is do it over in warzone from warzone private matches instead of instead of multiplayer private matches and save them in warzone online instead of multiplayer online okay guys so with that said let's get in on how to do this so we hover over create private match and then we get player two the controller with the player that is banned we enter in press a to enter them into the game and then we press b to cancel them entering into the game and then we just spam a on controller one to go into private match now that at that point while we're going into private match we want it to boot us back to the start menu because then that's when we will have the glitch right we need to get booted back to the start menu after we've gone into private matches and then when we load into the game our private matches will be online so let's get in and show you guys that happening so we press a on the band account and bring it in we press b and then we spam a on the other controller that's allowed to play get to this point here and then we were hoping that we'd get booted back to the start menu here. If you don't get booted back to the start menu here, we come into here and you'll see these all become locked, guys. Like in the past, these were all locked, but you can't save your gun here. So it's brought it online, but you can't save them here, guys. So as you see, we've got the online to here. So what we do is once we're here, and as you've seen, we're not going to be able to back out of here. So if we come to here, we cannot back out of private games right so what we need to do from this point is this is how and me just showing you guys that they've that's how they've patched the last one the last one was bringing your stuff here and then we would save it here see it didn't work that time because it did not boot us to the main menu when we got into custom games now if it boots us to the main menu when we get into custom games that's when it brings our class to here so there is a bit of a luck thing in this guys because you just got to hope that when you get into custom games it boots you back to the main menu and when it's loading for player profile guys so so we're going to go through and we're going to show you guys that happening if it doesn't happen guys what you have to do is you have to start from scratch again you'll have to quit app and you'll have to start up again just remember guys this is the after patch so it is a bit harder to pull off than the original 
Okay, guys, so you've seen what happens when you do it and try and save them in private matches that you just can't save them. It's been patched. Now let's show you guys how to go bring it into online, guys. Now what we're doing is we're not doing anything different. We are doing the exact same stuff. It's just that we're hoping that the game acts differently, okay? So when we go into private games, we're hoping that it boots us back to the start menu. And then we want to come into... into back into here and then we want to hope that it puts our private game class into here guys okay it's a lot of finger crossed for this glitch but with that said let's get in and show you guys it actually working so we do the exact same thing we bring in our band account and cancel it coming in and then spam a with the other account with our non-band account to get into custom games Just like so, and it will boot us back to the main menu. Then we want to load into the game and quickly go into multiplayer. With the account that's not banned. Like so, come across the multiplayer, come across the play, and then we should wait for a second. Then we should come across loading player stats. And now it should have our custom game classes, guys. It's simple as that. As you've seen, we just had to wait for that. And now we can save the blueprint. You see, it's just like a custom class, but now we can save it. B-Man YouTube. And you now have the new, the new gun saved as a blueprint, as the after patch, guys. So yeah, guys. They can't stop us. <laughs> New after patch. Get in there and get your M13C. Get down there. Smash that like button for me. Subscribe if you're not already. Leave me an awesome comment. And of course, make sure you guys have an awesome day. You can use this for any weapon. It's not just the M13C. And as you see, you can also use it for all attachment glitches to uh, equip attachments on guns that you don't have attachments unlocked for maybe it's fire blast shotgun shells on fires hey cheers for subscribing buddy and yeah anything anyone else that's not subscribed hey think about following suit hit that subscribe button this is the place to be to make your cod life easy and yeah guys so you can do all the weapons dlc weapons attachments on them and everything guys so with that said get out there and enjoy your day guys thank you for watching my videos and i'll catch you in the next one be man